What is going on guys and welcome back to the Hobbyist Miner channel. We are back at it today. Wanted to give you guys a quick update on our setup and uh, kind of everything we're running. So we did go ahead and kind of clear out some space here as you can see. Um, you know, this is kind of our, our gaming green screen setup. If you guys want to link to our, our gaming YouTube channel, uh, I'll put a link down in the description below. Um, but yeah, we have an Unraid box right here. Uh, it's right about 10 terabytes uh, running uh, Linux uh, Unraid. Uh, we got a handful of battery backups here. And then this is our um, gaming rig, uh, as you guys can see. Uh, got rocking, rocking all the rainbow look to it. Uh, this actually has a uh, 2080 Super. Uh, XC in it, uh, and it's also running a uh, Ryzen 9 uh, 3900X in there as well, uh, with 32 gigs of 3200 uh, memory in there. So she's quite a beast. We'll do a more extensive video on it in the future. Um, but uh, yeah, everybody likes a uh, 2080 Super, right? Uh, also running the Tough Gaming uh, motherboard. Anyways, you guys are here to talk a little bit about and learn a little bit about uh, what we're doing with our six 470s. Uh, these are the RX 470 uh, four gigabyte Sapphire cards that you guys see in front of you. Um, so let's talk a little bit about this setup and um, how we are achieving uh, 80 mega hash right now on Ravencoin. Um, so let's go ahead and take a look at our screen here. Let's see. Okay, cool. Um, so as you guys can see, we're getting uh, 81 mega hash right there, uh, broken down, uh, mostly 13 to 14 on each of our cards. Uh, there is one card that is kind of underperforming expectations. That's a little bit lower at 11. Uh, but uh, let's go ahead and talk about this a little bit. Uh, so uh, we're going to go ahead and jump over. Uh, let's cruise over to the computer and uh, we'll take a look and see kind of what we're getting here. So tour of our lovely basement, right? Okay, so uh, taking a look up above, uh, let's go ahead, you can see right now, our average right now is uh, 81.82 mega hash on uh, this. Uh, we haven't mined a ton, uh, I've kind of been messing around with stuff. Look at that, woo, $100. Uh, but as you can see under Ravencoin, um, right now it's going actually running at 0 0.07 so actually looking pretty good um, and in addition to that uh, we have mined a total of 430 raven coin woo so if we go ahead and look up up top here uh, let's go ahead and click in uh, and take a closer look at kind of what we're doing here um, so here are all of our cards our radeon rx 470 um, uh, with the Sapphire, a little bit memory uh, differential there uh, between the two. Uh, but uh, let's go ahead and take a look. So up top, you can see that we're running right around 65. Uh, that's what we have our auto fan set at. So if I go ahead up top and select our auto fan, you can see some of our auto fan settings. Um, so we're set to reboot at 90C. Our target core temp is at 65. Uh, target memory temp 90 and then minimum fan speed is 25 and max is 100. Uh, so taking a look here, let's talk a little bit about uh, our overclock settings. Um, so we are, well, let's talk about our flight sheet first. Um, so yeah, you want to send me some Raven coin, go for it. Uh, but uh, that in mind, uh, we are running uh, Team Red Miner and we are running to the pool of two miners. Uh, I've had really good luck there so far. Uh, and their payout is working really well. It's, I think it's like once a day at like, I think it's, I want to say it's like 10.30 uh, Eastern, but I could be wrong there. Uh, and then of course we're running on the Kapow algorithm. So let's go ahead and take a look at our overclocks. Um, and, and I think that's probably why most people are here. Um, so taking a look at our overclocks uh, for our Kapow algorithm uh, for Ravencoin. Um, so when you break it up here, it breaks it. You could have one number here, uh, but I've been messing around with individual cards recently. So we're doing 1100 for our core clock speed across the board. Uh, and then down below, a little differential here, 1950, 1950, and then our, on our fifth card, 1850 and 1950. Reason for being is that that fifth card um, seems to actually run into some issues giving us invalid shares. So that being said, uh, I've kind of taken it back a little bit uh, to be safe. Uh, so that's why it is at 1850 right now. 
Um, so let's go ahead and close out of this. Uh, but as you can see, we're actually running really, really well right now uh, across the board. Um, you know, each card is running right around, as you can see, look, 13, 28, all the way 26 and then down to there here this is that one that fifth card 1301 so just a tiny bit more um i did mess with going ahead and turning up uh from 1950 all went all the way up to 2010 2010 um on that but we actually didn't end up increasing our mega hash and all we did was increase our power and increase uh the heat that we were giving off so our fans started going crazy so as of right now, you know, uh, we are running uh, with, without actually having a uh, kilowatt gauge on the uh, rig outlet. It says we're running 738 watts. Now, I am not mining um, in order to break even and be crazy profitable. This is just a hobby for me. Um, so I'm not going ahead and underclocking these at all. I'm just trying to get, you know, just trying to mine as much as I can right now and not worrying about the electricity costs, not worrying about, um, you know, how much this is running me. Uh, but yeah, as of right now, let's go ahead and jump back over here to our setup. Look how, look how messy this basement is. Hopefully it'll be cleaned up sooner. We got LED light over here. Uh, we got another LED light over there. Um, so anyways, that being said, guys, uh, right now we have six 470s uh, that are running about 80 mega hash total. Uh, I have gone ahead and um, done some mining on Ethereum Classic. And on Ethereum Classic, we get right about 168 mega hash. Um, and Ethereum Classic is definitely more difficult to mine. Um, so I decided to swap off of Ethereum Classic and jump back to uh, Ravencoin. Well, hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video. Uh, if you have any questions regarding what I'm doing with my 470s, leave a comment down below. Uh, once again, it's been a pleasure hanging out with you guys. Don't forget to drop a subscribe. And uh, the YouTube, YouTube algorithm really pushes engagement. So please go ahead and give it a thumbs up and leave a comment down below uh, on anything that you saw here today. Until next time, have a good one, guys.